Our next guest is showing here at IFA in Berlin an innovative smart helmet. Well, how is it smart? Well, we're about to tell you and show you because, of course, video of all the radio interviews as well. So visit us at intotomorrow.com and check that out. He is a business developer with Tali Connected, and his name is Remy. Remy, welcome into tomorrow. Glad to have you with us. How are you? Thank you. Fine, and you? Good, thank you. We're uh, winding down several interviews from the Showstoppers press event, which is the official media event the night yep. before IFA opens, and uh, us media types are invited to come and and meet folks like you with really cool products, innovative by all means. Tell me a little bit about the company Tally Connected, and then we're going to show everyone this cool helmet. Okay, so we are Tally Connected. Uh, Tally Connected is a French startup dedicated to improving the safety condition of the bikers on the road. We know that the main reason uh, and the main cause of all the accidents for the bikers I do are due to a lack of visibility. Yeah. That's why we develop some uh, devices to help the, the bikers to, me, to be more visible on the roads and to be protected as well. Oh, very cool. Then now you've got to show us, because first of all, yeah. the last couple of interviews I'm doing, I'm looking over as you were waiting for your turn, and I'm thinking, wow, that's fascinating. This is this bike helmet, if you will, motorcycle helmet, right, yeah. uh, is is lit up and across the room. I could see it, let alone in traffic, because it would it makes it very visible. Why all the lights and all the colors? And again, into tomorrow.com, check out this video, and you'll see what we're talking about. So basically, the the, the main function of these uh, LEDs, those LEDs, are to reproduce the the, the turning lights and the braking the the, the, the braking lights, etc. During uh, the road, uh, let me show you. So, for example, this is the warning light. We can also have the turning lights on on the, the side of the helmet, like this. Okay, so even turn signals. I'm, I'm yeah, going to turn left, so I'm letting vehicular traffic exactly. know. <laughs> yeah, that's it exactly. And there is the the the, the brake the brake light on the back of the the helmet that will be able to be more visible on the road and it's working even if the biker is just slowing down and not uh, hit the, the brakes. Good, so it'll activate uh, red light in the back of this helmet yeah. to say to the traffic the behind users you, that, yeah. that he's Don't hit slowing me. down. I'm, yeah. I'm slowing down and, and <laughs> or it. stopping. Exactly, and all uh, the, the, the rest of the LEDs are more to, like I said, to, to be more personal, more unique. So you can actually put whatever colors you want, yeah, a exactly. mixture of colors and so forth? Exactly. Uh, for example, I can show you. So now I can change if I'm not saying... Sure. I'm gonna, while you're doing that, I'm going to turn it a little bit more towards Chris's camera so he can see the front as well. Yeah. So and you can see in the front, I can change, like, I put it in blue, then more purple, red etc. pink, okay. etc. I can choose. So you can have solid can colors choose. of the LEDs or a mixture as you were doing. Which that's is kind it, of exactly. A, the colors are dancing. That's it. And there is also, that's not all the thing about LEDs. There is also voice commands inside, uh, compatible with Siri, Google Home, and Alexa to use everything uh, which is connected for the, 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 the bikers, so for the example. So the helmet can become the smart speaker as e well? Exactly. So uh, the, the bikers can make phone calls, he can uh, put the GPS during his, uh, his path, and he can, for example, when he's going home, he can say, hey Siri, can you open the gates and enter? Nice. And he has not to, uh, you know, to uh, turn <laughs> off the vehicle and go right. open the gate, etc. Wow. So that's it. There is also a high-end photochromic visor that can adapt uh, depending uh, on the sun in less than one second. So, uh, the, so the photochromic visor. Visor, that's ah, it. Yeah. Okay. Photochromic visor. Sorry. Yeah, I was going to say it's a very, it's a rather large visor, and again, those not yet seeing the video at intotomorrow.com, it kind of wraps around the entire front of yeah. of your head. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. And there is also a, a fan system inside to cooling uh, the, 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 the inside the, the helmets during the summer, for example. We know that for bikers, it's important to be a little bit uh, comfortable yes. inside the, the clothes. Cool. And, yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so that's it. And it's working with 
our safety beacon, and this little dev de de device, sorry, is um, to the first functionality is to warn free people from the family or the closest friend in case of accident, oh, and it can okay. warn also the emergency services. Oh, really? And send directly the location of the accidents to help the bikers. So it can detect quickly. if the bike is, falls over exactly. or, or anything like exactly. that. Exactly, it can de detect a lot of data. Uh, for example, sportive data, uh, the acceleration, something like that. And also, it uh, there is a GPS tracker inside. And if someone wants to steal the bike of, uh, of of the bikers, it will receive. Uh, notification on the mobile app to say that there is uh, some suspicious movement with the bike and it will be able to activate a 100 decibel alarm on this uh, little beacon. So you would install this somewhere on the bike? Yeah, w okay. we can plug in on every type of motorcycles. Okay. Uh, it's working with, it's universal, it's working with everything and you can put it under the seat of the mo motorbike. Good. So, so this is really tech protecting us as well and protecting yeah. our property, in this case, a motorcycle. That's it. How soon will this helmet be available? Okay, so we are actually testing it and we plan to uh, produce it for the next year. So for the Beacon on May 2023 and for the helmet on September 2023. Okay, and do you have prices yet on either in US dollars? So yeah, people so have for, an idea? for everything so the mobile app the beacon and the the high-end uh, smart and connected helmet everything is for uh, 1290 euros okay so that's close to same amount in dollars these yeah, days, yeah more or less so. yeah that's it okay and it, and and uh, inexpensive at half the price because it's protecting you in many yeah, ways that's it. and very less likely to be hit by cars and trucks and so forth because you're much more highly visible that's it, exactly. Oh, very cool. And more information, you want to visit Tali Connected, T-A-L-I Connected.com, right? And, of course, Remy, we thank you for spending a few minutes with us. Very cool technology, and we love when people are using technology, especially for safety, helping to save lives and, and keeping people safe. So good luck to making sure you develop this. Let us know. Keep us informed. Thank you very much. It's our pleasure. Again, TaliConnected.com. And of course, yep, you guessed it, we'll get you there when you visit us at IntoTomorrow.com. Stay tuned because there is much more to come from Berlin, Germany and the IFA 2022. I'm Dave Graveline. Into Tomorrow continues right here on the Advanced Media Network.